hi guys and welcome back to my youtube channel um this is just a clean with me video but i also just have a message that i believe is from the lord the reason why i believe is from the lord is because i read it in his word i think that's so important that's why it's so important to actually read the word of god because then it can be easy for you to say the lord is saying to me and i found that actually to prophesy to my life and to direct myself i've needed to use the word of the lord to just gather his thoughts and what he says um and so yeah let's get straight into the message so maybe just a background um i had the most interesting year uh, i did not anticipate the things that would come in i actually left uh, my corporate job last year around september and i think from then uh things started to yeah dwindle and my faith became um shaken and that i feel like and i still will say that the lord was leading me it's just that i did not uh i did not get confident in him and i also did not uh anticipate the questions and the things that would come and the resistance that would come and then i buckled at the face of that resistance so <coughs> sorry for that i will not be cutting that out it's natural <laughs> So yeah anyway so that happened and from there I just started my life actually started going down finances my well-being my mindset um, the way that I think and then obviously it just rippled and started affecting relationships and um, with that a lot was happening happening around my family as well obviously leaving a job um, people not understanding why I would do that and um, just also being stressed out because I have kids and all of that and it started this weird journey which I'll, I'll actually call um, a journey actually to to actually going not going away from the Lord because I still was with the Lord but I just kept on being like God are you doing this i don't understand am i wrong and then obviously i started thinking from that place and started making decisions from that place that okay maybe i am wrong maybe i'm not hearing from the lord so let me do this let me do that let me get another job let me sort this out let me try in my own striving in my own might to get out of the situation let me speak myself out of it let me argue myself out of it and let me you know try and find answers for why things were happening the way that they were happening that being said i started fe uh, feeling unwell also physically and um yeah i was not well i had headaches i had heart issues and all these things that were manifesting in my body i think it was just stress and just the strain of it and i genuinely for the first time you know i've had fights with my husband and i not that i didn't mind but i wasn't of that that you know having that really relation that god is with me but it was for the first time where i was really scared because i was like lord i know that you want me to have a good marriage and i know you want me out of corporate but now why why are things not panning out the way that i saw in the vision um there's just a lot of things happening and also when i moved now to the to my hometown which was um the decision that okay if i'm leaving corporate then let's move back to the hometown and also try to see what the lord has there and then my mom my mom moved out and uh there was actually some friendships and a particular friendship which i thought now it had time to for us to revive it and and all of that um but it actually went the other direction and i just didn't understand that okay what is happening and uh it had been long distance so i understand there was a lot of growth that happened on both parts and a lot of things happening in different areas of our lives and us obviously not being able to communicate everything that was happening but i was ignorant um or i just knew that okay 
we were going to spend more time and we were going to try and do whatever um, that we um, that we missed out on and now it's time to mend everything and yeah that didn't work out um, but that led to also more on my side and I opened my heart to bitterness and resentment and all these things because I just didn't understand how things could actually go like that but um I went through that um and I felt sorry for myself at times until you know the Lord was like so yeah I can restore and I am a Lord who restores and the end of a met a matter the end of a matter is better than its beginning as Ecclesiastes um says so I also held on to that to say Lord if the end of this <laughs> does look better, I want to experience it. And I just wanted to encourage someone that is here, someone that is experiencing something, a season that maybe caught you off guard and you allowed maybe your heart to be bitter or you are traumatized or you are feeling some type of way about it to say um, that if you want if you wanted to change, it can change. The Lord does say that the end of a matter is better than its beginning. So do not look at the beginning of a thing, how it started and how it looked in the beginning, however chaotic it, it did, um, as the way that it's always going to be. The Lord wants to restore. And even as your year ends, I don't know how your 2023 began and what um, it had in store for you, but as it is ending, you still have time to just allow God to restore. And truly for me, I can say the end of my 2023 is much better, much, much better than the beginning. And that's what is important. How I'm ending the year, um, and I will not dwell on what happened at the beginning and the loss that I've encountered and all the things um, that I've allowed my mind to actually fall into. Um, and the enemy has used it to just create chaos in my life. But the end is that I still have my relationship with God. I am still going strong. I have been able to refocus myself and remove um, my mind from the negative and face the positive of what do I actually have? What friendships do I have? What people are around me? What things are actually happening right? And what is the Lord doing right now in this time? And that has allowed me to fully declare that the end of my 2023 is better than my 2023, the beginning. And therefore proclaiming that scripture that says that the end of a matter is better than the beginning of a matter.